everybody's favorite time of day, time to watch me open my mail. So let's see what Amazon brought me today. First up, we've got um, some more brood cacao. This was our emergency brood cacao that we ordered uh, from Amazon and not direct from the Creo brew makers uh, because we weren't sure if we were gonna get our package in time. And uh, Amazon has quicker delivery time, though they only have a handful of flavors. Now this is the Ghana light roast and it, um, this is one of my favorite flavors. It, um, it is very reminiscent of, of hot chocolate. Um, if you're wondering what brewed cacao is, it is like coffee, but instead of the coffee bean, they take the cocoa bean and they roast it and grind it the same way that you would do with coffee and you prepare it the same way that you prepare coffee in a coffee maker or French press or however you prefer your coffee to be made. So um, if you're curious about it, I would recommend um, trying out the Ghana light roast uh, with cream and sugar. It is very reminiscent of hot, cho of hot chocolate and uh, so it's a very easy entry into the world of brewed cacao. All right, next up, uh, we have another set of markers. Now this is a set of multicolored markers uh, for specifically, I bought these for bullet journaling. Um, when I first started doing bullet journaling, I wasn't sure if I was gonna like it, so I bought a very inexpensive set of markers. And they were already, the ink is starting to run out on some of them. Especially the black. So use the black one quite a lot. So let's try these out. With this fun case. I don't know that I'll use it. I like to carry my stuff around with me on purse, so I don't know that I will use this case. Day to day use, but it's a fun case. These markers there, I wasn't expecting this, they're triangular. That has kind of a fun feel to your hand. Uh, and these are really good for bullet journaling they're a fine tip and they also they uh, don't bleed through the page so that makes it nice for bullet journaling oh yeah I like these the nice smooth feel that's a good color there so I like that all right next package so last up I bought these also to go with my bullet journaling. Uh, these are some stencils. Uh, again, I bought some very inexpensive plastic stencils when I first started out, and uh, they're a little bit difficult to use because they are so flimsy. So I actually picked up some metal stencils. Uh, these I hope will be a little bit uh, easier to use. And I was not expecting this, uh, I knew they were going to come with a case, but this case actually is a Totoro case. So that's kind of fun and very unexpected. So let's try out a stencil. I'm not a super artistic person, so I do really like the stencils to add a little something to my bullet journal. I like this better already. Oh, plastic stencils. I'm just doing this in my lap. And it is pretty easy to hold this steady. I would not recommend ever doing the plastic stenciling in your lap. You tend to flop around and go all over the place. So here we go. Cute little cat. Almost looks like a ghost, but nice and easy there. I think I'm going to rather like these stencils. If you like watching me open my mail, then be sure to hit the like and subscribe down below. And I will have links to all of the products that you watch me open uh, down in the description below.